Welcome to the assembly of a typical drip irrigation system, and thank you for your purchase. Before you begin, inventory the parts to assure that your shipment is complete. This video shows how to assemble a typical drip irrigation system using a 3 quarter inch supply line. To begin, attach the assembled hose bib to the frame of your greenhouse. In this video, we use pipe clamps and wood screws. With the hose bib assembly secured in place, install the 3 quarter inch poly tubing that supplies water from the hose bib assembly to the rows of drip tape. First attach the supply tubing to the hose bib assembly and secure tubing to the greenhouse frame using pipe clamps and tech screws. To position the supply line at ground level, splice the supply tubing and use 3 quarter inch elbow fittings to run the supply line to the ground to install the individual rows of drip tape. Continue securing the water line using pipe clamps and screws. To complete the installation of the water line, insert a 3 quarter inch plug at the end of the water line. Rows of drip tape typically run perpendicular with the supply tubing. Drip tape can be connected to the supply tubing in a variety of ways. In this video clip, we show attaching the drip tape to the supply tubing using a hose barb with a lock ring. To create the drip tape connections, use a hole punch to press a hole into the 3 quarter inch poly tubing at the point where you want to position the drip tape components. Carefully push a quick thread hose barb valve into the hole created by the hole punch. Use our 5 8 inch drip tape to create any length needed for your system. Begin by measuring the length needed for the first run of drip tape. Before you cut the drip tape, note the 12 inch spacing of the emission outlets. Do not cut the drip tape next to an emission outlet. Allow a few inches between the outlet and the end of the tape. Drip tape components will not secure tightly if an emission outlet is at the end of the drip tape run. Once a length is determined, cut a section of 5 8 inch drip tape for your system. Insert one end of the drip tape into the hose barb valve attached to your supply hose and tighten the lock ring. After attaching the drip tape to the supply line, Insert the end plug into the open end of the drip tape and tighten the lock ring. Repeat the steps to install all remaining drip tape runs and related fittings to complete the system. Finally, connect the water or nutrient solution supply hose to the hose bib assembly. Test the system and adjust components and drip tape as needed to achieve the desired results. A properly assembled system allows efficient delivery of water and nutrients directly to your plants. Pressure controls help ensure that the correct PSI is maintained for your system, while a filter removes debris that may disrupt the flow. If you have any questions or simply want to order additional components, please contact our customer service department at 1-800-245-9881.